What's up everyone? Welcome back to Martial Metal Detecting. It's Friday, it's 7.30 in the morning. I got all my gear, ready to go dig up this privy, find some treasure. Remember, pinpoint that thumbs up button, subscribe to the channel, hit the bell notification so that next time I put out a video, you'll be notified. All right, let's go. <laughs> Here it is, let's go ahead and get started. See, I still have all my stuff in there that I uh, took out last time, like those uh, clay bricks. I'm gonna clean this out, I'm gonna go down a little bit. Uh, the plan is I'm gonna dig down maybe about a foot, see if I start hitting anything like glass or anything. I'll, I'll uh, pinpoint, I'll just make a pile of dirt out here in the weeds, and then uh, I'll sift through that with my pinpointer see if I get any signals otherwise I'll hit it with the metal detector again dig any signals go down a little bit farther I just kind of make my way down see how deep it goes I'm not sure how deep it is so we'll uh we'll find out all right wish me luck here we go here's the shovel I had see it's a pretty small shovel it's only about I don't know two feet two and a half feet long so this should be perfect inside of this little privy in here feeling all patriotic today check out red white blue USA USA all the way I already know there's not a whole lot right here at the top, probably at least six inches down. So I'm just gonna clear out about six inches all the way around and then uh, do some more detecting and then some more pinpointing. Got some roots growing in here too, but they're not very strong. So that's not too bad. All right, making a little progress. Got about a foot down, uh, a lot of square nails. Uh, I kind of gave up on digging them because I, I want to find some more, you know, better things. So check out my pile here. You can see that. So I've got, got about a foot down. Um, I just want to give you an update. So I finally came across, uh, looks like a piece of a plate. Um, so that's pretty good. Pretty sure that's what that was. Uh, so uh, I've got a pretty good tone down here, so I'm slowly digging it and that's how I came across this That planters peanut thing I uh, glass I found the last time I was here. I figured I found out what that was. It was um, a modern uh, peanut jar also found a five-hour energy drink in here, so Fairly recent stuff, uh, but hopefully, you know, this is a good sign uh, about a foot down See if I can uh, get some more treasure here all right, put you down and uh, I'll be right back. All right, couple feet down. Been digging real hard. So I'm about up to my waist to the ground as you can see. But finally came across my first find that's not square nails or bricks, tons of bricks in here. But anyways, it's uh, just some uh, steel and uh, I'm not sure what it was before. Sorry, my camera's a little out of whack here, but so yeah, anyways, um, so I'm getting into some different kind of stuff here, looks like. Um, so I'm gonna keep digging some more, maybe another foot down and might start getting into some real finds. Must just be a backfill that I was getting into or starting off with, and then maybe down another foot or two, hopefully I'll get something. If I can't go too deep, <laughs> I'll be able to get out of this hole. Uh, so let's see what I get. All right, stay tuned. I haven't found anything yet. Can you believe that? <laughs> I'm deep. I'm getting deep. Oh, man. You know, there's got to be, I don't care what era it is, a kid always throws at least one toy into the toilet. I'm serious. Come on. I haven't found anything yet. Oh, I got to keep going. It's about 9 o'clock. 
haven't stopped only to take a couple of drinks of water and make a funny meme and <laughs> look through look through some dirt a little bit but all right ah gotta keep going Yeah, I'm getting deep. I'm probably five feet in. Um, still haven't found really anything, but it's getting really easy to dig now. I mean, it's super easy. There's no roots. Uh, it almost looks like decomposed stuff. I don't know. Might be into the might be into the stuff now, but yeah, no, no real uh, finds of any kind yet. Just still, uh, still digging. A workout <laughs> oh here we go gotta dig some more so as you can see starting to get into uh, a different kind of material here it's not topsoil anymore it's just a real fluffy kind of almost looks like a plaster or something but it's really easy to dig the only thing uh, I'm finding still though is uh, square nails so going a little bit deeper I'm about, I don't know, still about five feet deep or so, but I'll go a little deeper, see if I can find something, but I don't want to get myself in a situation where it's not safe anymore, so cause I'm all by myself. So, um, but no worries, I can fill it in and um, there's a, I can go check out a couple more home sites and scout those out, maybe do a little digging. So, all right, I'm not giving up yet. I don't want to leave without something here besides square nails. All right, here we go. All right, it's probably about as deep as I'm gonna go. I went down another foot, just kicked it back over here. It's so easy to dig. I know I'm right there. I probably don't have too much farther to go, but I still don't like how deep I'm getting, how loose it is. I definitely would need to have somebody else here with me, but uh, oh well, I'll come back maybe again sometime, maybe with uh. Another person or two and uh really try to excavate this but we'll see maybe not i think i'm gonna head over i'm gonna backfill this head over and go scout those other uh locations see what i can get so yeah sorry bummer uh i didn't really uh wasn't as productive as i hoped it would have been but yeah i'm about that's about six feet down from what i dug in that little hole down there so it's about as far down as I want to get, I guess, for now. It's uh, too dangerous, so. Um, all right. See you guys at the next stop. All right. Let's give you a shot of the ground. Cleaned it up pretty good. Pretty much the grade. And then holes filled back in pretty good. So, I'm going to take off from here. It's about 10 o'clock. Go find the next spot out a couple places maybe I'd have them for lunch so all right thanks for joining me on the uh privy dig and I'll see you at the next stop met my second stop down the road and I'm gonna go right down here I don't know if you can see this there's a little fence post back here something took off right there some kind of animal ha. but uh let me go check this out. You can see that. Right, let's see if I can get in there a little bit. Let me go check out around that big tree out here. Scope this area. I don't know if there's any kind of houses back here before. Still haven't looked at the historical map, but I figured I'd scout it out while I'm here. All right, see you at the next one. Found a little creek. Right, right at this post here. That looks pretty old to me. So maybe this was an old farm site, maybe. So we'll check it out.
Got a pretty good signal right in here. Let's see what it is. I gotta pause the camera though. There you go. This is a little piece of metal of uh, some sort. But it has that kind of design on it. I'm not sure what this came to, or it came from rather. But it's pretty neat looking. Kind of wish I had the, uh, that carrot, uh, Garrett carrot, man. The waterproof pinpointer in here. But this is a nice little spring. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna check it out a little more. It's pretty cool. Pretty cool spot. I'm glad I should check it out. An old beer, beer can top. Cool. So there's a, it's like a brick, one of those clay bricks. That's pretty awesome. A couple of those in here I've seen so far, which is another really nice sign because obviously there's people around here at some point. Those aren't uh, <laughs> indigenous rocks. Those are uh, man-made. So uh, yeah, cool. I'm gonna keep checking this little creek out and see where it comes from. I like this area back here. Oh, there's some concrete right there too. You see that? All right, I found the, the pull tab to that uh, beer can or whatever it was I found, beer pop can. So I got that part. I uh, also pulled a big old nail out of here just uh, a minute ago. Still in the same spot. Um, haven't moved. Uh, and I'm also using the uh, pro pointer, but I'm just trying to not let the water get over the, uh, the power button that's where it can seep in there and ruin it so I'm just trying to be careful with this and pinpointing but this is a really neat little trick I love it all right let's try to get some more I got a really good signal right here could just be a nail I don't know we'll see but it's right it underneath this sand right here let's see if we can get it and get it live here I don't feel anything. Straight under there. Get my pro pointer. All right, it's under there. They found it. Just another one of these guys. So, oh well. Keep searching for more. It's old. Well, it's just right here. If you just look around the bend here, you got a nice little man-made waterfall, looks like. It's a little waterway. Right under this giant dead tree. You got a fence post right, right over here. And uh, so this might be pretty cool. There might be something in here we're finding. Maybe some old relics. So let's keep looking. All right, just pulled this out. It was just underneath the sand. I'm clean it a little bit. I don't know, what would you say that was? Maybe a, uh, a lid to something? Pretty neat design on it. Yeah, I like it. Throw it in the bag. I'm just looking at this, and it looks like there is some kind of insignia right in that inside of that circle. If you can make that out, let me know what it is. I don't really dare get getting in too far here. That's uh, poison ivy, so. I am super allergic to poison ivy, so I will, uh, I, I want to get right in here, so I might step over to the other side, see if I can get right underneath there where the water's falling in, and uh, see what we can find, maybe right up in here. Just got to be careful, I don't get any of that poison ivy, it'll ruin the whole week. <laughs> so, alright, let's see what we get. Alright, so I took a big scoop right out of here, see I'm just right next to the little waterfall here. 
Get a nice signal. There it is. Uh oh, what do we got? To open, pry out cap, flex spout, pull up spout with bail. What did this go to? Let me know. I'll have to do some research when I get home, but that's cool. Never found something like this. All right, see what we get. More to go. I got another uh, pull tab, and right in here, there's another signal, uh, kind of higher on the uh, detector, so I'll try to dig that next. Check out what I just pulled out. I thought it was going to be another pull tab. It's a spoon. Right next to the bank. Oh, it's not silver. It is stainless steel. What's our inscription say here? Insico Stainless USA. All right, cool. Have to do some research to see uh, when this might have been made, but that's always a fun find. So this obviously is a really good little spot. Um, you know, I've, and I really haven't strayed away from the creek yet. So there's plenty more to do. The grass is super thick and long back here, so it's. This might be a really good spot to detect in the uh, spring when all the grass is laid down from the snow melting off of it. Um, that's probably actually the best time to come back here, but um, you gotta watch out for the poison ivy, but maybe if I can sneak in around up to this tree over here and maybe get back in around here, but it looks like that poison ivy looks like it's grown all over the place back in here. So we'll take a look and uh, yeah, maybe I'll follow the creek down that way. Uh, it looks like it's coming, the spring is, that's where it starts. I mean, that's where it's coming out from, so. So cool. So if any of you guys are, you know, you don't have a metal detector, it doesn't matter. I mean, you can always find an adventure somewhere. I highly recommend getting out of the house and going, finding somewhere, like this is all public. This is all public uh, access. Um, and I mean, there's no one back here. It's just me. Uh, I mean, they got, they got working on a bridge over here, but man, get out, go, go find something. I mean, you don't get to find this stuff very often. Um, so it's, it's so worth it. And uh, it's peaceful and it's relaxing and um, it just makes you feel good. So get out, go find something to do. Um, go find an adventure and go take one. So worth it. Okay, let's see what else we can find, all right? All right, just right next to the fence post here. Got a really high tone, I can see it. It's right there. I get this just with my hand. Whoa, oh no, I'm getting soaked. Oh, that was a bit swampy right there. I'm soaked. It's all right. It's like a Miller Lite can. modern day so oh well i'll throw this in the bag and pick up the trash Maybe a little more but oh well keep on going miller time it's getting uh, a little closer to noon i'm gonna head back here shortly and uh have some lunch and go hang out with the fam but look what i just found I don't know if you can tell what I'm on. It's a concrete slab foundation. Not very big, but maybe big enough to get a car. Uh, maybe, a, maybe a car. Oh, what was that? Something just took off. Car, a little tractor or something in here. So yeah, that's a good sign. 
I think we're at a, a site here. Something to remember for next time. So, with that said, I am going to get out of here. It's been an awesome day. Privy didn't turn out too well, but I tried, right? That's the uh, best thing you can do. Only one way to find out if there's anything down there is to dig it out. So I did that and uh, found a couple of relics over here at this creek. Oh, I did go down there. I did go down to the other end of this. And uh, there, it just it kind of turned into a swampy area, you know, you know what I mean? So um, I didn't hang out there too long. I went over here by that big tree, by where the uh, spring comes out. I uh, didn't really find anything at all. So thought I'd try this tree and found this little foundation here. So good news. Um, still have a couple more home sites to, to check out. I uh, won't be today probably, but um, we'll see maybe this later this weekend or in the summer for sure. So don't forget, if you liked the video, Go ahead, subscribe to the channel, pinpoint that thumbs up button, give me a thumbs up, and hit the bell notification so next time I put out a video, you'll know. All right, thanks for watching, everyone. Get out there, find your treasure.